do you know I suppose it had to happen that even a channel like mine would get caught up in the retard net of Google's restricted content um, I mean mine's not a political channel or anything like that it may not be going against what Google would deem to be correct information or what they would deem to be anything else but look if I this is the 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 video that I put up yesterday, right? Now I had to do it in this browser because when I when I when I checked it in when I was logged in, um, I don't want to you know give the information away or I don't want to give my email address and stuff because I get enough bombardments on my server as it is. Um, by oh I don't know what you should call them, but never mind. So let's just go down the bottom here. Like, as you can see, it's working. So let me put this restricted mode on because you know we all need this in our lives, don't we? It's, um, Put this restricted mode on, save that, and look at that. And it's not just on this, but I can't be bothered to go through the whole lot. But a lot of my uh, videos, the, the comments aren't allowed. Because, I don't know, some weirdo. I, I, don't, I don't know what these boffins are doing. But they're not boffins, though, are they? I mean, like Google's stolen. It's a stolen word, in a way. It just means very large number. It's spelt differently, Google, but it's still Google. Um... Google Chrome isn't really Google Chrome, it's Chromium, ripped off by Google, because if you don't nail it down with a patent, you'll get a corporation like Google come along and say, hey, that's ours, and claim it as being theirs, and add a few bits and pieces, change the colour of the logo only, and just chuck in a load of ads and other crap, and then call it theirs. Ah, <sighs> Do you know, if this wasn't a free service, it just wouldn't be worth it, would it? But that's, that, that, this is it, this is, uh, this is what they're doing. And so now what I've got to do, it seems, because there's no way you can contact these weirdos. You can't just email them and say, why are you restricting this particular channel? Um, I don't understand. No, you've got to write to them. Or you've got to fax them. But you've got to write to these people. So the customer service is absolutely bullcrap. Now I did look on, um, There's apparently there's a whole help centre dedicated to me at my uh, my email address. And I was going to show you, but it doesn't, like, just get rid of my email address off the screen. And sorry for the help part, it's all for me. And it's all talking about Samsung TVs, uh, iPads, iPhones, and uh, Mac operating systems. And none of these things I have. And there's not one thing on the so-called help thing that get, which is uh, specifically towards my email address, my account, that's got anything to do with me. Morons. Absolute morons. So, I managed to get caught up in it as well. Even my channel. So it doesn't seem like you can do anything these days, is it, without being claimed as a terrorist or something? Dear, dear, dear. And I still live in a world of vaporizing aeroplanes where buildings just fall, free fall down to the ground and that's all accepted but I can't even get a video to be played in restricted mode.